welcome to Digging Deeper, where we help you lock eyes with Jesus and take a step towards Him. Today's scripture reading is Acts chapter 28, verse 23. God's word says this. When they had appointed a day for him, they came to him at his lodging in great numbers. From morning till evening, he expounded to them, testifying to the kingdom of God and trying to convince them about Jesus, both from the law of Moses and the prophets. We see in this passage that the Jewish leaders have come back to Paul for a second time, and they're meeting with him at his place of residence, which he's currently imprisoned. And it says here in the text that from morning until evening, Paul expounded to them, that he testified to them, that he was trying to convince them about the coming kingdom of God and the coming kingdom's king, Jesus that Paul is convinced that all of the Old Testament promises, everything from the law of Moses, everything from the prophets that makes up our Old Testament is pointing them to Jesus. And so Paul's giving them everything that he's gotten, that from morning till evening, he's expounding, he's testifying, he's trying to convince them because he is convinced that Jesus is the Messiah. Now I read a passage like this and it challenges me of, of, If I was pressed, could I expound from morning till evening? Could I testify to the kingdom of God? Could I try to convince those about Jesus from the scriptures? I know that there are a lot of things that I personally could talk about from morning until evening, but is the kingdom of God one of them? Is is the beauty of Jesus one of them? And this passage challenges us to be people who are well-versed in our Bible, who are well-versed in our relationship with Jesus, because if we believe in Jesus, if we have experienced the presence of God, then we long for others to experience the presence of God. So may we be challenged by this text. May we be convicted by this text to not just be followers of Jesus who sit down with our with our hands beneath us, but instead the people who would use our mouth, who would use our words to expound, to testify, and to try to convince those about Jesus. Let's pray that God would give us that kind of heart. Our Father, I thank you for your word. I pray that by the power of your spirit, Acts chapter 28, verse 23, would change us into the likeness of Christ. And Lord, in the same way that Paul expounded and he testified and he tried to convince, Father, I pray that we too, God, in the spaces and places you've given us influence, that we would see them as opportunities, God, to speak of your goodness, to speak of your power, to speak of, Lord, the way that you change everything. So God, would you grant us opportunities to do that? And would you give us the courage to say yes? Father, we pray this now in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.